Hi folks, I hope that you guys are doing pretty well. Uh, so today is Monday, the 12th of February uh, 2024, and this video is going to be my 40th World First Biblical Deciphering. And in today's video, I want to decipher for you uh, in the book of Revelation, chapter 18, uh, verse 16, okay? So um, if you head over to the book of Revelation, okay? And you go to chapter 18 and go down to verse 16, okay? Now I'm going to show you a marriage between Revelation 18, 16, in which I'm going to decipher for you now. And how this prophecy is actually also married to Revelation 16, 19. Now I decipher for you Revelation 16, 19 very recently. It's my 38th World First Biblical Deciphering. Now, when I say World First Biblical Deciphering, I say this because it is God that gives me the divine knowledge to decipher these Bible prophecies. So, I'm going to show you the marriage uh, as to how Revelation 18.16 uh, is actually married to Revelation 16, verse 19, uh, which is actually right here okay now um let's go back now and i'm going to show you some interesting things okay so revelation 18 16 right here and it reads and saying alas alas that great city that was clothed in fine linen and purple and scarlet and decked with gold and precious stones and pearls Okay, now, when it says here, alas, alas, it's almost like saying, you know, uh, woe, woe to that great city. Now, I told you when I decipher that prophecy in Revelation 16, verse 19, that after the great big earthquake, okay, the Vatican is going to be split into three parts, and the Vatican is actually the great city, okay? You know, how do we know? Because look what it says here in the context. That was clothed in fine linen. Okay, clothed in fine linen, of course, you got the, um, you know, the Pope and also the archbishops, if you like. And the bishops, they dress themselves in white, fine linen, and also in purple and scarlet, you know, the, the caps, if you like, or the head wearing. It's sometimes it's purple, I believe, for, for the um, archbishops uh, and a scarlet, if you like, and decked with gold and precious stones and pearls. Okay, well, you know, um, we know that uh, the Pope wears a ring, okay, a gold ring. Also, um, you know, the archbishops, they tend to wear gold rings as well you know, with precious stones and pearls, like it says here, okay? But um, we know that the great city uh, is actually the Vatican because if you go over to Revelation 17, okay, uh, you know, it does talk how uh, mystery Babylon, uh, you know, in my view, it's Vatican because it says here that, uh, and here is the mind, which has wisdom, okay? So if you are actually going to have a bit of wisdom here and understand this, is that um, Mystery Babylon is actually located in Rome, but it's actually the Vatican. We know that the Vatican, uh, it's sitting, if you like, like it says here, or the woman seated, okay? We know that uh, it's talking about, um, you know, the mother of harlots, okay? In other words, Mystery Babylon, okay? The mother of harlots. Now, uh, then the Vatican sits, uh, you know, in the city of seven hills or seven mountains, okay? Like it says here, which the woman is seated. And the city of seven hills and seven mountains is actually Rome. And that's where the Vatican is actually located, okay? So, um, then Mystery Babylon, and the mother of harlots and abominations of the earth is actually uh, the Vatican, okay? Which is located in the city of seven hills or seven mountains, which is actually in Rome. Now, um, getting back to the prophecy of 
Revelation 18, 16. One of the interesting things that I want to tell you how we know that Revelation 16, 19 uh, is actually, you know, when it, when it talks about the grace, it is actually um, the Vatican. It's because here we got a whole bunch of clues, you know, how the Pope is dressed in, 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 fine, in white fine linen, if you like, and also the archbishops and the bishops. Um, they wear a purple uh, cap, if you like, or, or scarlet in color, and, you know, they have rings made of gold and also crosses and things like that, okay? Now, the main point here, how I got it uh, underlined in red, Great City, is because there is a match, okay? So if you head over to Revelation 16, 19, which I decipher for you, on my 38, well, first biblical deciphering. So head over to uh, Revelation 16, and then go over to verse 19, okay? So in Revelation 16, 18, there's going to be a big, massive earthquake, such as there the never was upon the earth since man, uh, you know, since, since God created man, basically, okay? A big, massive earthquake. And the great city, this guy says the great city, that's that's none other than the Vatican only. So the Vatican, it says here, after this great earthquake, was divided into three parts. There is no doubt about that, that the great city, uh, was, in other words, the Vatican was divided into three parts after this great earthquake, okay? And see how it's called the great city here. Now, if you head over to... Um, Revelation uh, 18.16, okay, and the great city, okay, and saying, alas, alas, that great city. So do you see the match, great city, that was clothed in fine linen? The only city that can be clothed in fine linen is actually, is talking here in reference to the Vatican, how I just told you, you know, the, the Pope and the uh, archbishops and the bishops, they all are dressed in white fine linen, they wear purple, uh, caps, if you like, scarlet clothing. They are decked with gold, you know, rings and crosses, precious stones, if you like, on their rings and things like that, and pearls. So this is the key word that, or the key, or the two key words that you need to take to note that the great city, okay, is actually the Vatican. Um, so what you need to consider then is that uh, Revelation sixteen nineteen, like I just showed you. Uh, you know, when the Vatican is actually split, split into three parts, it's actually married to Revelation 18, 16, okay? There is a marriage here. These two are married together, okay? So uh, just to recap then, folks, and finish up this video, uh, just bear in mind that um, Revelation um, 16, 19, that great city, okay, which was divided into three parts, okay, uh, which is actually um, the Vatican is actually married to uh, Revelation 18, 16, okay, here we go, the great city again, okay, so we got a match there, all right, so Revelation 16, verse 19, is actually married to Revelation 18, 16, we got all the clues, and you know, if you do read Revelation 17, uh, yeah, this is all about the Vatican, if you like, uh, the whole context. And we got a marriage here. All right, folks, thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you guys later.